So we are team BSB plus and I'm Frisa Uh, I'm, I'm Yang. Xu Liu. I'm yeah. Xiang. For the project news, what are we what are we changed since last vote? A different vote to the academic page and make talk less colorful. Designing and the designing database structure. What we have done, first we have done construct a low file and high file prototype for different view. Database eternity relationship diagram and database high file Excel demo. What we are doing, the website UI design improvement, constructing different view for, for course gauge. Um, we'll add two more schedule view to have a multiple way to visualize the course schedule. For the calendar and view, course, and course will divide by into on several terms. At the middle row, it shows the course that are recommended to be taken at the, each term. And the course term could uh, be dropped to the last row, that's a class planning schedule. And for the Kanban style view, it is separated into three clones Cross complete, cross in progress, and uh, the left the left course that you not take yet, and uh, the last clone could show detail about the uh, overall class progress, like how many credit hour left, how many course left. Next, next, oh, yeah. For the high fidelity, basically have the same element as the low fidelity, but there have more graphics graphs to visualize the cross information or program details. At the middle of the Kanban view, the exam, the, this example of the graph shows the class grid distribution. Yeah. And uh, we have uh, received an uh, unexpected uh, problem, which is related to the uh, IT support of UFR. Uh, they refuse to provide our uh, us the uh, database of student and our course things like that, and so uh, we have to build our own database. And uh, this is our entity database entity relationship diagram, uh, which uh, basically is three parts. The first is uh, course part. Uh, each course has uh, zero or more. Uh, prerequisite courses and uh, with uh, the foreign course ID with uh, uh, prerequisite uh, requirements and also each course has zero or one lab and uh, the lab has following uh, information lab information and uh, we have combined the, all the instructors including doctor professors uh, and the lab instructors all the all those in one database and there they can share the uh, foreign uh, instructor ID so they, they can know which instructor related to the lecture or the lab and also for the second is a student database which uh, each student can have have a uh, their own info uh, they together have a, a student info database and each student can have their own a grid table I, uh, for their entire academic uh, semester life. And also there's a faculty uh, database with a faculty ID and a faculty name. And each faculty can have their own uh, program database, which uh, includes their name and title and full name, and also their uh, graduation uh, academic uh, courses. So we have built this uh, hi-fi uh, style Excel demo. With, uh, let me show here. Is, uh, each page in indicates uh, one database table and uh, their columns and their data types. So you can see these are examples of how the database may look like. And we may add some other columns or features later based on our need.
uh, we will uh, show our web page demo. Uh, this is there is an academic schedule builder page uh, for students to see uh, what the, their schedules and we also will recommend schedules uh, to students and show what course they completed and what course they need to take. And we also add some different views. We can view this page by uh, tables, which is more clear. Uh, this, this is a table form. And also there we can uh, see the detail of our default schedules for different term. And uh, we, we have tagged what the, where we are now, like term two is a current term. And we have some optional class and uh, some courses schedule. Uh, in our uh, low file, uh, we have some errors, but we decided to do not use them because once there are uh, lots of classes, this will be a mess uh, for course completing. This is our Kanban style, uh, which we can see it's very clear to see the class information and for the uh, for the completed in progress or course depth. Also, we build some visualizations visualization right side to show how much we uh, finish in this program. So next is our semester schedule builder. Basically it's going to let us uh, build our schedules and see the details. And also a, a view of midterm, final exam. And we can drop our class to the, into class list to, yeah, draw, draw, drop it, we can do this, okay, class. This is our database. Uh, this, this is a database showing for students to understand each courses. Yeah, so basically we would have a homepage, but we, re, uh, we abandoned and changed to about us. We have, yeah, this is about us page. We will put this page in a very, uh, uh, in the very bottom. Uh, yeah, that's our web page MVP. Uh, for the term summaries, first uh, we uh, set up our project, uh, basically build a uh, docu document about the business cases and the problem requirement. Also build some prototypes. Uh, next, uh, we create our architectures, including some user cases sequence uh, diagrams and the prototypes uh, build lots of high fidelities uh, and also do some uh, basic front view codings. Then, uh, then we will build the, it's going to the advanced uh, progress. We build our uh, calendar and the Kanban style views. And the most important is set up the web servers and our database for the future, we build our database on our servers and we will optimize our beta database and the web views. And so, okay, then going to the plan and the reality. Priska? So for the plan BS reality, the plan is a colorful, interactive, and visualized online course recommendation and registration street. And some changes we have made and less to make it less colorful, build our own course database. And most proud to gain the to gain the experience of building a website from sketch from sketch. Like the database server from them and some other connection. And the stuff and thing we planned need more thinking for the UI design. For the four web plan, well, for, the, for, for our application, we plan to do some, to build up some database construction and to set up the server and advise the web view and start of the next ENSE 477 we will continue with the connecting the database with the web view 
So for the group reflection, uh, what did you feel we are on track? Yes, still working on page construction and perfection. Do you feel there are very to your statistics? Mm, there is lack of experience, experience and take time to learn while applying what we have learned. Do you need any help going forward? Mm, so far, no. Okay, so that's our uh, vlog number three. Thank you for watching.